All right, so this is my sixth lecture mini project for Intro 4320. Um, this time, what I've got is an LED that basically blinks on and off, uh, and there's also a photoresistor in the circuit and a potentiometer and a switch. Um, so the potentiometer is used to vary the speed at which the light blinks, so I can make it go faster like that by spinning the potentiometer here. Um, the switch allows me to control whether it's digital blinking on or off, or it's a sawtooth wave, so it gradually gets brighter and then dimmer again in a linear fashion. And then I can slow that back down with the potentiometer again. And you can see that it starts dim and then gets bright and then goes dim again. Um, the maximum brightness is determined by a photoresistor, so right now it's somewhere in the middle range and the computer also displays the range there uh, which ranges from 0 to 255 so right now it's around 176 if I put my uh, hand over the photoresistor you can see that the LED maximum brightness gets dimmer and that drops down to the 26 uh, which is 10 percent of the maximum volume which is the, the lowest it can go and then if I turn my overhead light on um, the LED gets much brighter to compensate for that and it's kind of hard to see on video but you can see on the screen here that the value is now 248 which is close to the maximum of 255 and just for a display one more time I'll go back to the sawtooth wave uh, go, to the go back to the digital wave and then the other one was the sawtooth wave and, you know, the same brightness deal works with both of them so I can cover it and it'll get dimmer and I take my hand off and it'll get brighter And that's it.